Who cares? You tired or not? Nobody care about you. But if you come here, don't complain. Mm. You want to become best. You want to become champion. If mm. you don't want, call us. Somebody go else. back. Go yeah. back to Dagestan. Without you or with you, there is always going to be champions. With your name, yeah. this is your choice. Yeah. You want to put your name there? Okay, work hard. No? Bye-bye. Mm. Very simple. Nothing special. Like he's just always in his own world. He really quiet for real unless he know you. He's funny as hell though, but if he know you type shit, you know what I'm appreciate saying? your six pack unless you didn't have one and you had to earn it. That's how the world works. And if you're not cut out for it, then fuck off and live a normal existence and die. Sit there, letting other men enjoy the spoils of being a man, fade into history unremembered. If you want to level up your character, then you need to get out here and do it. You need to be around brave men. You need to get some balls. You need to get your network together. Listen to the truth. Humble yourself. Stop sitting there with the ego. Realize you ain't shit. Most of you fuckers could go and look in the mirror right now and be on it would I fuck you. And the answer for most of you is no. I wasn't born this way. I absolutely not really made myself this way. And any single one of you men out here can do this. Yeah. Well, embrace what? I love being a man. Embrace what? Masculinity, baby. You feel me? That's all I love, bro. F that feminist shit, bro. It's not okay to be fat. It's not okay to be f***ing lazy. Fuck that shit, bro. Embrace harsher. Work out. Learn to f*** fight. Control your emotions. Don't be a f***ing doctor said, you are going to die. You are going to die. He says, you have got to get off the drugs you're taking. He was taking steroids and he was taking coke and he was doing a veteran. He goes, this is my dream. My life dream is to be on the Olympia stage. He competed at the Olympia. He got last place and he died about two weeks later. I cannot truly say I survived, but something did. Something better. Usain Bolt, look at the time, 958 world record. Edges ahead, Bolt pulling away. People have a lot of talent. And this is going beyond your talent. So when talent, when there's no more talent, what happens to you? Most people quit. People only go to their talent level. And once your talent level is gone, it becomes a mental game. That the whole mental game sets in then. And most people can only perform to their talent. And they realize, man, why am I always messing up right here? Mm. Why, why, why is this like my big, my big hurdle? It's because you're performing to your talent. And then after that, your mind has nothing for you. Mm. Nothing for you. I see. I see fighters. I see runners. I see people who they're great, but they get to the edge of their talent. It's like, fuck, man. What? What's? What's up? Because you're now at the point now where your talent ain't gonna do shit for you, my friend. Now it's the mental game, and that's where people get lost in life. Get lost in that next level, and that next level is found for me in the things that I do. Let's see if you uh, go in the gym and you do a squat 20 reps non-stop, bam, 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 your legs are going to be burning. And that burn is what's telling you it's hard, and that burn is telling you to stop. And that burn is what's telling you to stop at the top and rest because it's hurting. Well, don't stop. Make it hurt. Whatever makes it hurt is good. You know, no pain. Fucking no pain. scrolling if you're sensitive because this shit's about to get real. The only reason why you're not hitting your goals is because of your shitty fucking mindset. It's got nothing to do with your lack of time. It's got nothing to do with your shitty situation. It's got nothing to do with the lack of support. It's got nothing to do with any of your excuses because it's a human condition and we all have fucking problems. We all have shitty situations, but the difference between you and them is they chose not to make it an excuse. Everybody's got fucking problems, but only some of us choose to find solutions. You're not special. Now get the fuck to work.